Hey everyone, so let's talk about let's talk about the actual elephant in the room. Let's talk about Robin Hood today. So be sure to smash that like. It only takes you like two seconds. Robin Hood just listed Shiba Inu. What do the big influencers say about it? And what is next for ship? What does this mean for Robin Hood? Robin Hood did release some new news that involves Shiba Inu. So let's take a look at this. Contrarian approach. What a yeah, way yeah, to counter that. that. Yeah, Robin Hood just listed Shiba Inu this month. Like, how are they going to be in business in five years? They, they missed the boat by like a year and a half. Like, they, and then I guess Kraken missed the boat by a few crack. months because uh, they listed it well after Coinbase. Let's not talk about Kraken. <laughs> oh. oh. Keep, I keep jump the back Kraken to out your mouth. E Toro. Oof. Yeah. So I all of these Shiba listings and Shiba Inu is still dominating, which is really, really exciting. But what's next for Shiba Inu? That's what I'm really, really excited for. So, I mean, Jake James, you, men you mentioned eToro. And, I mean, you realize their spokesperson used to be Alec Baldwin. And you know what he does to his castmates. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, watch The competitive now. landscape is bad. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's bad. It's That is not slander. Proven. So, yeah. I do jumped you, ahead of a question there. Sorry. No, no, it's fine. Yeah, because it's coming to you and you knew it. You were feeling it. Now, do you think if uh, if they are unable to recover from all of this, what happens to the company? Does it get absorbed? Does someone buy it? Do they just dissolve it? Like, you know, what happens to them if they can't if they can't make it through? Well, there's one of two possible scenarios in my mind that could work. I think that they're not beyond salvaging. I think that they've done some serious wrong to retail, as Tom and Wendy have alluded to. But I think, like uh, like Aaron is saying, they're also just a company that at the end of the day is after profits. So they can do things to correct course. They can. But one of these possible scenarios that plays out is that they continue on the path that they're doing right now where they're saying that they're doing cost cutting measures but behind the scenes we don't know how bad it really is and then they have to continue doing cuts as the economy continues to worsen so robin hood took a huge hit even after listing shiba inu mind your biz did such a good thing but um robin hood makes significant strides in crypto businesses in quarter one despite falling revenue the popular discount brokerage listed four training tokens in quarter one 2022 uh, but it's not enough for Robin Hood. Robin Hood is still taking a huge hit, especially after listing Shiba Inu. Uh, it, it still went down. It, Shiba Inu did not save it. And people were saying, you know, Robin Hood just listed it one and a half year too late. But, you know, same as uh, Kraken and some other exchanges. Some other exchanges did it at the perfect timing, like eToro. But again, on April 28th, discount brokerage platform Robinhood published its financial results for the first quarter of 2022. Year over year, the firm's net revenue declined by 43% to $300 million, which is still a lot, but Robinhood is taking a huge hit on the market, and this could be in turn bad for Shiba Inu as well, because if nobody buys Shiba Inu tokens, if nobody uses the Robinhood platform, nobody will buy ship, and, and therefore people will only sell their ship. If people are not buying, they're only selling, right? So... Despite a decrease in sales, the company's net calculated funded accounts rose by 27% year over year to 22.8 million. At the same time, total assets under custody increased 15% to 93 billion. Once fully integrated, we expect the service to help accelerate Robinhood's ability um, to uh, to do great things, to serve Bitcoin remittances on global scale virtually no cost. We will be important for international expansion. This month, Robinhood signed an agreement to acquire Ziglu, a UK's big electronic money institution and crypto firm, which, you know, is a big thing. So what's going to happen next with Robinhood? Is it going to crash? You know, they listed some other coins and most importantly, Shiba Inu. But Robinhood plans to integrate with Bitcoin payment protocol Lightning for fast transaction with lower fees. As told by Robinhood, uh, Shiba Inu is basically taking a huge hit. So it's not doing that well. It, it, it's not doing that well as it should be, but it could be doing better. But be sure to smash that like button. I'll keep you guys updated. Uh, do you think Robinhood will go up or down from here? You know, depends on the market, but the market is right now pretty steep. Shiba Inu is holding strong. It's a little puppy and it's stronger than ever. It's not an old dog like Dogecoin. I'm just joking around here, but, you know, both are little puppies and they deserve to be treated very well. So hopefully all goes well and be sure to smash that like button. I'll keep you guys updated with more Shiba Inu news. Peace, everyone.